Hello guys, you are once more welcome to this channel. Today we have another interesting question. We are given that the absolute value of 2x minus 3 plus the absolute value of x minus 2 is equal to 4. And we need to find the values of x that satisfy this equation. Recall that the absolute value of x is equal to x if x is greater than or equal to 0, or negative x if x is less than 0. Therefore, the absolute value of 2x minus 3 is equal to 2x minus 3 if x is greater than or equal to 3 on 2, or 3 minus 2x if x is less than 3 on 2. And the absolute value of x minus 2 is equal to x minus 2 if x is greater than or equal to 2 or 2 minus x if x is less than 2. This leads to four different cases. And we are going to analyze these four cases using the number line below. Here we have to partition this number line into three regions using the critical values. 3 on 2 and 2. So let's say here is 3 on 2 and here is 2. Now, if x is greater than 3 on 2, the absolute value of 2x minus 3 will just be equal to 2x minus 3. So here is 2x minus 3 and here is 2x minus 3. And if x is less than 3 on 2, then the absolute value of 2x minus 3 is equal to 3 minus 2x. So here is 3 minus 2x. Also, if x is greater than or equal to 2, then the absolute value of x minus 2 will just be equal to x minus 2. So this is x minus 2. And if x is less than 2, then the absolute value of x minus 2 will be equal to 2 minus x. So here is 2 minus x, and here is 2 minus x. From here, we have to add these two expressions in each of these cases. In the first case, we have 3 plus 2, which is 5, and the negative 2x minus x, which is negative 3x. In the second case, we have 2x minus x, which is x, and 2 minus 3, which is negative 1. And in the third case, we have 2x plus x, which is 3x, and negative 3x minus 2, which is negative 5. But we know that this sum is equal to 4. So this is equal to 4. This is equal to 4. And this is also equal to 4. In this first case, we have x to be equal to 1 third. In the second case, we have x to be equal to 5. And in the third case, we have x to be equal to 3. From here, we can identify the solutions to this equation. We know that 3 is greater than 2. So x equal to 3 is one of the solutions. But 5 does not lie between 3 and 2 and 2. So x equal to 5 is not a solution. We also know that 1 third is less than 3 and 2. So x equal to 1 third is another solution to this equation. Therefore, if the absolute value of 2x minus 3 plus the absolute value of x minus 2 is equal to 4, then x will be equal to 1 third or x will be equal to 3. Thanks for watching. Please do have to subscribe to this channel and to share this video.